Okay, so I just wanted to make this quick little video to help some of you that have asked me how to do this, to, to explain how you can uh, split your audio between your streams and your, your VODs, and like avoid certain applications like say music you're trying to play to go to the VOD. So that way you can just, in your downtime, you can play music, and which will not mute your VODs because of that, because it will not go to the VODs, right? So I'm using the latest OBS, OBS 28, and um, which makes this a little bit more, more easy because previously you needed to, to have the audio split in desktop audio and stuff like that. Now it actually allows you to capture application audio directly so you can do it, you can do everything inside OBS. So let me show you how to do that. So first of all, let's create like a application audio capture, right? Let's say we call it Spotify 2 because I already have a Spotify 1. And then it's just, you just select the window, right? Or Spotify. Press OK. And now we have a new source here, right? So what happens now is that if you play something on Spotify, right, kind of appears here. You can adjust it just like you would. And, okay. Now suppose you don't want this music, this lovely music to, to appear on your VODs. What you do is go to settings, um, output, and you make sure there's a setting on streaming. You make sure there's Twitch VOD track. And you make sure that's enabled. Uses track 2 in this case. What this tells OBS is that um, anything on track 2 will go to the VODs. Right? So you enable that. Press OK. And then you go to your audio source and advanced audio properties. And see, you see Spotify here. Spotify 2, right? In this case. You just deselect track 2 here in the tracks. And there you go. This music will not appear in any VODs or any clips. So you can just have music on and off. Like you have key bindings for the music to start and play and etc. It's 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 cool. Right? Have fun. <laughs>